There we go. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Look at that guy. There we go. First one of the day for me. Welcome back everybody to another episode on the channel. Today's episode guys, we got a special one. We have the guys from Burley Fishing down here today. And uh, we're collaborating. We're doing a collab on the Mississippi River. I guess there is a big uh, a big tournament kind of deal derby going on. So I don't, I don't we're gonna know. We're going to win. We're going to win. We're not even in it. But we're not even in it. But we're not going to lose. That's the big thing. <laughs> so we're out here, guys. Hopefully it doesn't get too packed up. This place is known to, to get packed. But I, so far, I haven't seen a lot. I think the guys that are fishing here are pretty diehard. But we're going to throw out some tip ups right now. We kind of just did a bunch of holes. The ice is a lot thicker than it was the last time we were here. We're going to throw them out for bass pike. We got a bunch of shiners. Hopefully that goes well. Haven't had a good tip up day, unfortunately. But Today, Today's with these the guys, today with these guys, it's the day, and we're gonna start jigging. So stay tuned, guys. It's gonna be a good one. I'm gonna link Burley's channel down below in the description. So please go over there, share some love. He does a lot of really good content. So stay tuned. That wasn't too bad, actually. Guys, we're gonna grab these tip ups. Grab the uh, the wax. He's got the old pink polar tip ups today best color and we're gonna throw out some uh, throw some shiners and see if we can uh, get some good old, good old pike and bass out here all right guys we're gonna get this this tip up out since I'm right here with it get out a good old shiner down in there or we I'm gonna start off with the old Wonder Bread jig you know me and then we're gonna throw on a white plastic if you also have been watching the channel for some time you know that this is kind of my bread and butter or I go with the white jig with pink um, that's just what I go with guys I really think I don't know on the Mississippi I like to keep it simple that's the setup it works well um, we got tip ups out uh, Burley's over there. They just got done setting up another one. So we're gonna go ahead and and uh, Get in this hole here and see if we can't catch one Let me grab my gloves though because my hands are honestly kind of cold and There we go. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. There we go. There we go. That's a good end right there. Like yeah, first one. Choked that jig, guys. Choked it. Heck. Yes. What's that? Six feet, dude just came up. Classic, classic crappie presentation, flew up on it. Look at that guy. There we go, first one of the day for me. Paul's over there killing him. You know, Jeff is just having a good time with Lauren. I'm just sleeping. Dude, you and Lauren need to break up. I think Lauren and you are on a different path. Let's go see if we wanna throw this one on. Might be a really good keeper size for right now, guys. See what we got here. This might be another keeper here. I'm, I'm, oh yeah. I'm I think so. There we go. Some of the there we go. Yeah, we might as well just. Dude, that's an absolute keeper. Dude, that might be, dude, he hammered it. That one's close to fishing. No, he hammered it, man. That's close. Oh, the one, the big one that I got. Just yeah. Whole there we go. Yeah, I just. Well, it's I when I first fish. drilled that hole, I looked at it and I was like, man, this looks pretty good. Yeah. Go back over there. I'm fighting with finicky fish, and then this huge red mark just comes up. I'm like, yep, it's about to happen. So, dude, I'll, I'll show you what I'm looking at. Got one. One good keeper. Now we got to get back in here and see if we can crank another good keeper. Here comes one. There we go. Oh, good. There we go. Another good in, man. <laughs> That's another good crappie, guys. There we go. That's another good keeper. 
Oh, you got another one? <laughs> oh, yeah. Dude, dude, there's a bunch of huge marks in that one, that, man. That, a boy. There we go. Dude, Wisconsin Wild Man is getting on him, Sean. Dude, boy. Look at that, baby. Oh, God. <laughs> Flipper. Uh, professional. There we go. Yo, dude, that is a slab. Yeah. All right, guys. So, caught two nice ones out of here. There's plenty of really nice marks. Rocking the Wonder Bread jig with the white plastic. Now, Paul's running a purple plastic, and he seems to be catching them as well. So, I don't think there's any... I don't know. Maybe it's just where we're at in the water column. I'm sitting about five to six feet is where I drop down to, and I just wait for them to come up to it. Um, but they're sitting down about ten to 15 feet and they're coming up off the bottom and they're just hammering um hammering the jig at like five to six feet but that's that's my preferred way to do it is watch them come zooming up off the bottom there just got to put my plastic back on but i love watching them come up off the bottom because then you know like you're probably getting bit like you're not like having to go down to them and anything like that if they come zooming up you know that you're probably going to get a bite but no tip-ups yet unfortunately i wish we did have some tip-ups but and drop this down and uh, I'll kind of try to describe what's going on here so right now it's about six feet right there so I'm just gonna pop it a little bit I'm not gonna get too crazy and already we have a mark starting to move up yeah here he comes he's coming pretty quick now there's two of them three of them I think they're competing I might get bit here so I've got some big marks right on the jig Yep, there he is. Got him. There we go. Not that one's not a keeper, but still, the crappie are biting, man. They are biting. Another crappie. Not a not a keeper, but we're gonna put that one back and get right back in there, guys. Hopefully, we can get another big mark. Okay, here he comes. He's coming pretty quick. There we go. That's a better one for sure, too. There we go. Another one. Not a keeper, though. Holy cow, this guy choked it. Oh, my God. Holy cow, dude. He swallowed it. It's a good one. Like, just so throw it in a different hole. That same hole spooked those fish down there. Because I caught like three really nice ones out of there, caught two small ones and threw one, threw one in that hole and then I was like too lazy, threw the one in, and then now they've been a little more finicky in that, that hole. Be, uh... Oh, here comes one. There we go. Just a little guy. Another one. Man, we're on the crappies here. Shoot. Little guy. Still on yeah. Dude, they're loaded up over here, I'm telling you. I had to slam four holes in the shanty right on it. <laughs> there we go. Bluegill. Not a big one, though. Smaller gill. Not a big one, but... Oh, get in there, buddy. The old Wonder Bed jig with the white plastic once again. I'm telling you guys, it's just keep it simple. You ain't gotta get too fancy out here. Just keep at it jigging, eventually you'll get something going. I think it's more or less just how you're jigging. Dead sticking it, giving her a good pop. I got white yet. Oh, there we go. Here, drop in that thing. Look at that, another guy, another crappie. Awesome. Go drop in there, dude. I think Kelly's coming anyway. I'm gonna talk to Kelly quick. Okay, to yeah, go yeah. take advantage, crush him, dude. Another get or another <laughs> gill crappie. Another good crappie. I don't know, he's really borderline keeper though. I think we're gonna have to just put him back. We're on a little bit better ones than that. Yeah, that guy was like, yeah, I don't know, man. Though, right? yeah. All right, here we go. Back to the, the wild man special here. Oh, yeah. Wild man special. There you, go. you guys rocking a waxy yet? Yeah, I am. You want one? No, I'm rocking the plastic. I'm full confidence in the plastics. Full confidence. 
It's not there that we go. I've already beaten my day with a waxy now. Yeah, buddy. Nice. Oh, that's. I told you, full confidence in the plastics. Full confidence moments later. There it is. <laughs> you know what I am all about, about the plastics. Dude, dead stick, yo. Dude, we're having a good day on the ice, oh, surprisingly, absolutely. though, honestly. Oh, yeah, another crappie. Just keep her rolling. You know, the funny thing is, is like, I've had two people come up and ask me for catching crappies. All right, guys, so that's going to wrap up today. Here we go, dude. <laughs> With Burley Fishing, the guys there. Uh, today was a, it was productive. It was productive. We're doing the outro. I wanted to do it outside, but it's cold and pretty windy. But we, we got on some fish. Unfortunately, the tip-up game didn't really go. We filmed some really cool stuff out here today. It was super fun. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. Like I said, guys, go check out Burley Fishing down below in the description. These guys have a lot of great content over there, so I highly, highly recommend you guys go and check them out but other than that guys we had fun oh yeah. a good time definitely gonna have to do it again like, yep. and, like and subscribe uh, heck yeah remember to like and subscribe to the channel we'll see you guys on the next one